Rachel Bodies. What it is, is how I was. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Head northwest. So, I'm in traffic. I'm in my son car. If you know, you know. I hate driving his car. This motherfucker lit up like the Fourth of July up in his pee. Just got it out the shop. So anyhow, anyway, I'm scared to touch stuff. You know what, what boys do with me. I'm just scared, scared to touch stuff. Let me fix his mirrors. So I'm on the way to pick up my baby from school. Um, not her school. Well, I guess you could say she got two schools because, y'all, because I'm trying not to have the girls out too much. I got on a cute little red set that I got off of Amazon probably two years ago. But anywho, she go, she's in a criminal justice program. So um, she's a junior. So on B days, they have to be picked up from their other school. Ain't got something. But that's not what I came on here to talk about. I came on here to talk about a few things. Um, and it's lives life, y'all. Because I was thinking about kids missing school. And I know I saw something. I think it was Taylor. We all was her channel. I watch it all the time. It's just a brain fog right now. What is it, y'all? You know. If you know, you know. So I was watching her videos. It could have been Destiny something, too. I can't remember offhand. I just wanted to talk while I roll, roll and talk. Um, but, y'all, them kids miss 80 days of school. This is old news. But I thought about that. School just started. I've never been one for my kids, to, my children to miss school. I had, I had five. I have five, but the, I only have one remaining um, in school. Just my last baby is left. Um, she's a junior, and she's the bomb, but anywho, 80 days of school make, missed, I, I can't recall how many days of school they have in a year, but I don't give a damn, you have to prove to me that you're sick, I don't want you here with me, uh-uh, you gotta go to school, but D, you gotta get up out of here, if you ain't got diarrhea, and a, 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 a real bad fever, Oh, you going to school? Mm hmm I don't need no company throughout the day, especially when you work from home. Nah, I don't need you finding shit else for me to do. I got enough to do. Period. Point blank. 80 days of school? That's just pure laziness. That's just because you don't want to roll up out of bed before 1 p.m., get them dressed, and take them to school. That's a break. That's what I call it. When you have a lot of kids... That's your break right there. I'm dropping you MFers off. Mm-hmm. You ain't got to be here with me. Shit. That's one less. What's that? Two less meals? Because you're going to get there early. That's two less meals I have to worry about in my household. And five little people I don't have to take care of until about 3 o'clock. Call it what you want. That's the way I looked at it. You want to stay in here with me, buddy. Y'all, these lines in Texas... When they picking these kids up for school, it's fucking dumb. Dumb. I hate it. That's why I'm glad my daughter is older. She will be driving probably before a second semester. But I need you to walk down a little bit because I'm not getting in that line. What the hell no. I'm not that kind of mom. I don't have to pick you up at the door. You can walk down the street. And I will see you and turn around and pick you up. But yeah, you going to school over here. Grandkids, let me find out my kids ain't sending their kids to school. Because my grandkids go to school. Well, Aiden's been going to school for a couple of years. The only time he missed school is when he's sick. And he gets sick. When he's sick, he's sick. He has asthma. So he has to stay home. Thank God I didn't have to deal with that. India starts school Monday. And I already know her mama. She going to school every day. What time? How late can I pick them up? <laughs> That's the kind of mom I'm what I was. After school, you got extracurricular activities I, that they can be involved in. 
Yeah, I'm trying to pick up my baby so she don't have to wait too long. Um, but that part, send them kids to school. Shit. Save some groceries. Just because you lazy and don't want to get dressed is not a fucking excuse for them kids not to go to school. And I saw the live, her TikTok live, I want to say was Kate. Taylor, is it Taylor XO, y'all? I don't know. Don't give me the line. I do know, but I don't know right now. But I saw her live that she posted of Olivia's TikTok um, live on there with some guy who was um, asking her all these questions, going through all these questions with her, which, which was weird to me. But he had people in, in her is live saying you know basically she's a liar about everything and she was lying she was lying through her fucking teeth i got five kids i got all i got custody of all five of my kids bitch no you don't you don't <laughs> living your truth she told these people she, she was telling this man that he she had only been on youtube for two on tiktok for two days now we know fucking olivia ain't been on tiktok for two days she was telling this guy that she only has three baby daddies. Bitch, you lying. And the truth ain't in you. Literally, the truth ain't in this hoe. Um, what else did she lie about? That she was never married. What life are you on here living? Because is this like a, a, your alter ego? Because um, it, it's giving thirsty slut whore to me you know because you but i always say if it's got something to do with a man with, with a dangling something with a dangling she all for it but when it comes to them kids where's my mommy you know my nah, honey your mom your mama didn't lay down and make them kids although she probably assisted with you having that freedom to do so but yeah, this man read her like a book. I thought he was I thought it was really strange. The man was strange to me. I don't know what y'all think. But what he was saying is he saw In a quarter her, mile, turn right onto the I-635 North saw ramp. Olivia up in, in in one quick fast hurry paragraph. She was done. He read her like a book. And it was the whole truth and nothing but the truth. That you can't go no you you can't whatever social media platform that you run to you have disgusted so many turn people. right onto the i-635 north ramp you have disgusted so many people that they gonna follow your ass and they gonna make your life a living hell if you can't tell continue on i-635 north for four miles but I was just wondering, who is this man, and why do you need you and your wife need to investigate um, my YouTube channel for what reason? To know if you need to follow me, bitch, just don't follow me. That that part I didn't like. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? <laughs> You's a regular, smegular human being, just like everybody else on this platform. Who are you? I mean, were were you lining her up with a job? That's different. What, what, was you finna put some money in her pocket? That's different. You know? Let me know what y'all think. Um, I'm driving. I'm not editing shit. I'm just gonna post it. And I know y'all gonna leave me some comments. So go right ahead and do so. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I do reactions every now and again. But I just can't watch the same old train wreck over and over again. And always have something to say about it. I'm sorry. But that was very entertaining and odd to me at the same time. But she was on there blatantly lying. Alright, let me know what y'all think. Love, peace, and hair grease. I'm out this thing.